Hello there, my name is Mark Barnabas and welcome to an Eye on Privacy where I share about tips on cyber security and data protection. So today I've got an article here uh, from Forbes magazine and this article is for all you bosses and managers out there and this title goes like this, your employees are integral to enterprise privacy and this article from Forbes magazine shares three key tips for protection. You know they say that a uh, company is only as strong as its weakest link or rather a chain is only as strong as its weakest link. So if the company is a chain then the links are the employees of the company. So it's very important that we make sure employees in the company are kind of aligned with all the cyber security protocols set by the company because no matter how much protection, no matter how much technology, no matter how much uh, robots uh, companies use to put in their cyber security, it is really the human that is the integral part to keep the uh, integrity, the security of the company and the data it holds. So this is three protection tips shared by uh, co-founder of Living Security and here it goes. So the first is to understand your data inventory. Just like a retail shop that takes care of all the items it sells, a company or every company that holds some form of data should understand what data they hold whether it's personal data, whether it's company data, whether it's just important data that will help them in their business like secrets and recipes. So make sure you know your data inventory, what is uh, governed by privacy laws and other uh, legal re re regulations. Second is develop a culture that comprehends, comprehends what? Comprehends the importance of data protection and privacy. So a lot of times when I've done training for organizations, we see a lot of the senior uh, managers or the, the top people, but a lot of times uh, uh, the rank and file, the operation staff are omitted from such training or they're just given very simple training. However, it is these operational staff who often handle data and could unfortunately be the cause of um, breaches. And it has uh, been noticed that cyber uh, syndicates or cyber criminals not only attack the top brass, but they also attack managers and even uh, employees because they would prey on any weaknesses of the organization. And like we said, the chain is only as strong as its weakest link. And if the employees are the weakest link, I'm sure some cyber criminal would prey on that. And third, Tip is to manage devices. Today we have so many smart devices that connect to the internet or the company's database. So all these devices that we have could be at risk. So are you protecting your devices? Have you got a minimum endpoint security at least to ensure that these devices are safe from praying eyes, right? So these are some devices that we have to take care of especially the cell phone yeah all right so and also not just your work devices but how about smart devices like fridges that connect to the internet i remember there was an article that was uh that shared that a cyber criminal attacked the company through the air condition not through uh, a, a working device like a cell phone or a computer but it attacked through IOT because apparently the air condition was a smart air condition and it was connected to some uh, server, Wi-Fi and somehow the cyber criminal attacked the weakest point which was the connection provided to the air condition and that led to the server. So be mindful of all devices, not just work devices, but every single smart device. And today with the use of IoT, I think it's really important that we take note of the cyber security. And one more point to remember, web cameras. How many of you have web cameras at home? Did you know that web cameras, yes, being on the web could be hacked. So 
be mindful of this, okay? So, three protection tips for you. Understand your data inventory, develop a culture that comprehends privacy and data protection, and of course, manage your devices. So my name is Mark Barnabas. I'd like to share with you that I've got a game called Data Heist, the first ever learning resource dedicated to educate on data protection and cyber hygiene. I would love to gladly share this with you. Just ping me and connect with me. And these are my social media creators. Feel, feel free to connect with me. Hope you like this video. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And feel free to connect with me if you'd like to find out more about what I do, as well as to find out more about Data Heist. So my name is Mark Barnabas, your data protection pal. Be good and be safe.